Okay, I wanted to do a quick video about the ZD Racing MX-07. Um, I pre-ordered one and uh, maybe two weeks ago now I got the email to say it was there and I could either opt for free freight on a boat and taking two to three months to New Zealand or to air freight it and that is what I ended up doing and it got here in just under 14 days. For anyone else that's looking at buying one beer with no electrics like I did. Uh, one thing is it still comes with the motor cooling fan setup um, which I didn't realise so I actually ordered one off AliExpress um, and I am running the um, Hobby Wing 150 amp ESC and the 2600 kV motor um, which would seem to be way less than what a lot of people are running um, and a lot of these bigger things um, but it as you would have seen in my first wee video is definitely not slow although I am running reasonably decent batteries we'll have a look at one of my batteries um, so you've got all the details on there 4S um, in the previous video I did a wee little few skids in the car park you know, the yard at work um, but yeah after that I actually was getting it hooking up and it was just well standing the entire way across the yard um, at the moment I have got the punch set on the second from punchiest setting so um, four out of five uh, I'm thinking about winding it down to three um, but I'm going to take it for a skid today, but yeah, seeing it in real life, I'm really happy with the quality, um, like the aluminium shock towers are nice, how they've got the nice machined lip, the brace that runs down through to the centre brace. What you should do is get some verns and have a wee measure, see what it actually measures at, dun dun dun, what have we got here, what have we got here, can we get it on the camera? Right, other things to note that, um, well for some reason mine didn't come with any clips to hold the body on, so I um, pilfered some R clips from the workshop at work. Um, it does come with a pinion gear, which I also didn't realise and I had no idea what size to be running. Um, so I took a stab in the dark and I actually ordered off Ellie a 14, a 15 and a 16. Um, but for your information anyway, they come with a 13, so I'm currently running the, the stock 13 tooth um, with this motor setup. We will have to take it for a bit more testing and see if we need to go bigger, but I don't think speed's going to be an issue, it seems plenty fast. Damping wise, she's got heaps of damping. I'm running, well, it actually takes quite a bit of force, but now I'm running... Um, stock they have no spring preload, the spring preload adjusters it, you know, backed right off. I've got 9mm on the rear and 7mm on the front, um, so we'll see how that goes. Um, but yeah, all in all, she seems like a really good bit of kit. Um, you can see the front bracing there. Um, so yeah, I think apart from like super extreme abuse, you know, you're not really going to be breaking one of these in a hurry. So, yeah, super happy, and I need to get someone to come and do some recording with me so we can capture some action shots. So, um, watch this space. We will have some, some jumps and some sending it in the not-too-distant future.